Hello Gemini, welcome to your almost daily love reading. This is Chelsea and thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate your love and support. Hope all is well with everyone. And Gemini, please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it will not resonate with each and every one of you. Time is an illusion in tarot, so this reading could resonate with you in the past, currently, or in the future, okay? Now Gemini, let's find out what are your love messages today? Spirits and angels, show me important, accurate love messages for Gemini today. I don't know where did that sound come from. <laughs> Possibly from the outside. Did you hear that? Gemini. Love messages for Gemini. That was interesting. That sound. I hope I wasn't the only one hearing it. <laughs> hope you heard it too. Show me. Gemini. Gemini, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be you or the other person you're thinking about or dealing with, okay? Alright, so I'm seeing the High Priestess, okay? Possibly in the past, somebody was keeping secrets, okay? Some secrets with the High Priestess here, but this could also indicate intuition, you know, um, keeping quiet as well. Doing your own thing with the Nine of Pentacles could either be you or them, just taking care of your business, taking care of yourself, um, working, you know, building something here. Um, but something more like, you know, that is tangible, something that is more solid, uh, mostly something of value, work. But all in all, the Nine of Pentacles um, is an indication of someone embracing his or her singlehood. Okay, it doesn't matter. It's not gender specific. And just keeping still and quiet about it. Just There's something so serene about this energy here. The High Priestess, I don't know why suddenly I'm just hearing, you know, meditation. Maybe someone recently has been meditating and trying to get get themselves um, back together okay or to basically being able to focus on what's more important to them in their life whether it's you or them five of swords in reverse this could be an indication of not wanting to fight throwing in the towels not wanting to be played again or you know mind games manipulation however the world is in reverse here so it looks like someone may not have moved on and still feel very still feels very stuck about someone here in the past okay whether it's you or the other person but there is an effort that i'm seeing here to you know for this person to actually try their best to not uh be part of the drama or the games or you know and really trying to isolate themselves i can see that i can feel that as well from all of this negative energy here Hierophant is in reverse. So definitely you're going through a separation between this person in the past. Maybe it has something to do with someone keeping some secrets. Um, and also we've got the temperance here. I feel like Gemini, someone here is being very, trying to be very patient. You know, despite that, I'm sensing this energy of despite of not being able to move on, feeling still stuck in the past. But, you know, um, I like the, this energy where regardless whatever that is going on right now um, between you and this person someone here is trying to be very well balanced and trying to be very patient with themselves and with this situation or could be with the other person as well but temperance here could also be an indication of making peace with the other person or to reconcile as well this could also mean that but all in all gemini the surrounding cards is definitely showing us a lot of patience someone here is being extremely patient the strength card could also be an indication of patience one two three cards here like 
to me, it indicates stillness, be patient, handling the situation very tactfully, very delicately, and very patiently as well. And also we've got the devil in reverse. I feel like it is, it is an attempt to actually remove oneself from this connection that they know it is unhealthy for them, okay? Again, in the past, maybe someone was keeping secrets or could have lied, could have cheated, uh, or could have, you know, put you in a third party situation. Sometimes the devil card could mean that, but the devil means a lot of other things too, bad habits, addiction and whatnot. You should know what is unhealthy in regards to your connection with this person. Or maybe that person is not healthy, you know, as in they're toxic, have toxic behavior. Who knows? But Gemini, what I'm seeing here is really regardless, regardless what you're going through right now, you know, I feel like you could be practicing patience, okay, which is, which is really, really good. Um, also, trying, trying your best to actually move on from this connection, to release yourself from this connection that is obviously very unhealthy, right? It could be you or them. Again, roles can be reversed. Queen of Cups is in reverse. Maybe at one point in time, you know, with this one Queen of Cups in reverse and King of Cups is also in reverse. Both of you, you know, these two are actually uh, um, a true pair, right? Same, same water energy, king and queen, doesn't matter, male or female. Um, again, it's not gender specific. But Gemini, what I'm seeing here is that both in reverse, I feel like maybe both of you could be mirroring each other as well, okay? But it also could be an indication of emotional instability, uh, it could also indicate someone uh, trying, wanting to express how they feel towards you or you wanting to express how you feel about them, but someone is holding on or holding back, okay? Um, but eventually, I feel like someone will come forward to express how they feel and to send you a message. All right, Gemini, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. And also, I do personal reading my information is in the description box below if you'd like to book me if nothing else gemini i hope to see you tomorrow as i post your video almost every single day take care gemini bye